Who are you? Oh, it doesn't matter. Just help me open this door. I packed my tools in here, seeing it was vacant. But now somebody's gone and locked the door. I'm a blacksmith. I'm nothing without my tools. Bring me that key. Chop chop. I'm a black bring. to my uh, shop. I'm Morlin, and I, well, I sell armor. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. I could really use the business, if you'd be so kind. I came from the west, from Volgan. Have you been there? It's a lively place, vibrant with trade. Very competitive, of course. And you, you have to grease the wheels to get anywhere. But I didn't have the funding for that, so I left home in hopes of striking gold. It's been years since then, and I've, <laughs> well, I've made very little headway. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm still here. Everything's all run down and dying. It was t terrible for business, really. The group calling themselves the Blue Sentinels have gained much power in Volgan. You can't even run a shop without their blessing. They claim to be working for the greater good, oh, but it's absolute hogwash. <sighs> oh, by the gods, why the hell am I here? I do hope I see you again.
Oh, undead, are we? And one without much time remaining. Just about ready to fall apart, I'd say. Not exactly the time to be chatting with a cat. <laughs> well, suit yourself. Oh yes, you may call me Shalqua. Enchante. So, what did you want anyway? Ooh, you smell wonderful. <laughs> This place is already dead. Everything will crumble and waste away so that something new may be born. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> this place is fascinating. We receive only the most peculiar visitors. Folk like yourself. It's enough to keep even a cat amused. <laughs> Are you going to see the old ones? Those four who have grown so incredibly ancient. They must have sprouted quite a thick coat of moss by now. For heaven's sake, no one even knows their names anymore. Imagine that. <laughs> yes, nothing like yourself. For you have a most pleasant scent that grows nicer with each passing day. <laughs> have you made friends with the man by the sea? He's lost everything. Absolutely everything. <laughs> the only thing he's good for now is a few tidbits on covenants. Covenants are a type of, well, contract, you might say. You give something to gain something. That's the way humans like it, right? It might be just the thing you need. But what does a cat know? <laughs> Did you see that oddly formed rock behind here? Long ago, they called it Victor Stone, as I recall. If you wish to face greater challenges, speak to the rock. Although, you'd just as well not. <laughs> this place is all... Ev is nothing suited you, I presume? Well, that's dismaying. <laughs>
business with me. The way you're under is all blocked up, you see, by this god office statue. Heavens above. Who thought it a good idea to pit it there? Oof, I'm in quite the pickle now. See that statue? Gives me the willies. You stare at it for long enough, it starts to look alive. Ach, it just doesn't seem quite right. There are no craftsmen round these parts. Hey, you don't think a real life person was turned to stone, do you? See that statue? Ach, hey. Is that a shard you found? Here, let me see it, so that I may help you. To see light, to see hope, however faint it might be. <laughs> 